Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So finally, I'm going to get to you guys my account tour. All right, I wanted to grind for Hercules first, then I pulled a hit monkey, wanted to rank him up first, and now I can actually go through my account because it's pretty stable at this point. Okay, now next level up, I'll be doing more, but for right now it's stable. So I'll show you guys what my account looks like right now. So first, let me show you my profile. This is my profile, okay? Um, you see how many heroes I have, my base hero rating, my prestige, which I recently got up. All right, there's my top champions. And here are my dual stats, all right? And my stats. I want you to look down there at my PVP fights one. That is an indication of how I have developed my account. All right, now you notice that I do have the sigil. I want you to also notice that I have a title, Elder of the Universe. The reason that's significant, let me show you guys, is because you get that when your account is at least six years old. So I have been building my account for over six years. The sigil was not out then. By the time the sigil was out, my account was already developed and the sigil does not help. It really doesn't. Um, there are some little things like um, increased inventory, quality of life changes. But by the time you were where I was, when the sigil came out, it wasn't going to help you a lot. You know, who, who cares if you get a few extra five-star shards when you're past five stars, when you have all the five stars, you know? So um, just to let you guys know that this account is largely free to play uh, except for the sigil. So for some of you, that might mean it's not free to play, but this is how I developed my account. So you don't have to have the sigil. You can still do this, but that's how you're going to have to do it. Grind that arena. Must grind arena. Shout out to Dorky Diggity Dave. All right. So with that said, let's take a look at my account. All right. We'll look at my six stars first, sort by rank. All right, so I have a number of champs at rank three. And all when I'm going through this, I'm not going to give you all the stats. You're gonna see the stats up here. Uh, I'm gonna post the stats of how many champs are at rank uh, three, four, five, whatever, uh, depending on where we're at. So like for this one up there, you're going to see uh, three, two, and one. All of the uh, stats there, okay? So this is what it looks like here, my six stars. All right, and you'll see how many six stars I have and all of that. See Hercules, he's not awakened yet, but I did take him up to uh, rank three. I'll get him awakened eventually. All right, there we go. Got some good champs. Now, if you've watched some of my uh, crystal openings, I'll get a new champion that nobody likes, but it's new. That doesn't matter because it helps me build my roster. The more six stars I have, the easier it is to grind the arena. All of these six stars and my five stars together got me that Hercules. And I did a, a easier grind than a lot of people. I think I, I came in a six. So it, it helps. It helps. Now, of course, I refreshed and boosted uh, a lot, uh, about 5,000 units. But it would have been more if I didn't have uh, the champions that I had here. So now I've got a nice, nice, sizable uh, six-star roster. And I, I have a lot of them that I want to take up. 
to uh, rank three. But for right now, I'm slowly taking certain champions to rank two, uh, the ones that I like. All right. So those are my champions there. Uh, let's switch over to my five stars. Okay. And you'll see again the stats up above. And I have, I would say I have all of the five stars except for exclusives, but I didn't go for Toad and I didn't go for Sauron. I'm going to start picking up five stars from uh, crystals or from the basic arena from now on. But there, those were all of my maxed out uh, five stars. And I don't take up five stars to rank five lightly because it uses up a T5 basic. But sometimes I have too many T2 alphas in my overflow. So I'll take up uh, a rank three five star to rank four. That doesn't use my T4, uh, I mean my T5 basics, but it will use my T4 basics and my T2 alphas. All right. Um, but I'll, I'll show you at the end how many I don't have and who I don't have. And you'll see Sigil Witch in there. But that's only because I'm saving to get the uh, six star again. Because I already have her. You saw her. But I want to get her again to dupe her. Uh, and then I'll pick up the uh, five star Sigil Witch. All right. But yeah, when I when I grind the arena, unless I'm actually going for a champion hard, I don't even go through all of my five stars. No need. And you can see I can take up some of these guys to rank four. But not yet. See, I got Thanos, got Kang, all in the same opening. All right. So look at the champs I don't have. Abomination, Black Bolt, Captain America, Deadpool, who is behind a paywall, Electro, Gold Pool, never could pull one, Iron Fist, exclusives, Rare, exclusive, Miss Marvel, Sauron, like I said, Sigil Witch, Toad, Vision, Wolverine X. That's it. These are all the five stars I don't have. Now, if any of these are in the uh, featured five-star crystals, then I will uh, start opening those up and trying to get some of the exclusives. Otherwise, I have no reason to open five-star crystals. This is what I was talking about. Five-star shards, what, what, what does that mean to me? You know? All right, let's uh, go down to the four stars. Now, the four stars... I have a lot of four stars, uh, and you'll see up there, uh, at max level. All of my four stars currently are ranked four or five. All right, and if you watch my rank up videos, you've been keeping up, you know how I rank them up. Usually during an advancement, I'll take some up, but yeah, every one of them now, are rank four or five. So that makes uh, the grind and summoner trials much easier. All right, um, it's so much easier. I can easily put up 2 million in one sitting and not go through all of my four stars. Um, but right now the only champs, and I don't wanna take them up to rank five because it uses up T4 class catalyst that I need to take up my six stars. So I have to be careful. I will take them up, but only if I have a lot of that particular class catalyst. Like right now, I think I have six uh, mystics in my overflow. So unless I'm gonna take up uh, a six star, which would take T5 basics, which I don't have, but like one right now, uh, and I wanna use those up, I'll take up a mystic to rank five as a, a four star or a five star mystic to rank four. 
All right, so here, that's it. Deadpool, which is behind a paywall, Sauron and Thanos. That's it. And I will have Sauron as soon as he comes to the contest. Um, I'm think, yeah, uh, I'll get the four star Thanos. I couldn't get the four star Thanos. I do have the four star Kang, but not Thanos. So I have pretty much every four star in the game except for these three. And I will have Sauron uh, when I'm able to get him. But Deadpool, unless they release him from behind that paywall, I won't have him. Um, he came around just recently again, but again, he was behind a paywall. And uh, yeah, not, not doing that. All right, whoops, didn't mean to go there. All right, so three stars are in the same situation. But uh, as far as me having all of them, except for uh, certain exclusives, however, it's a little different. Uh, I have all of my three stars here maxed, and I have all of them. Um, except for, and you'll see at the end, let me just uh, scroll a little faster because it's, it's all of them, okay? And it's better to show you who I don't have. But all of them, as you can see, are at max level. There we go. I don't have a three-star Sigil Witch. I don't have a three-star Deadpool. Again, behind a paywall. And I don't have a Sauron. Okay? So that's the three stars. Now, the two stars. All, wait, no, no, not all of them are maxed out. I have a few, uh, a couple, I think, that I have not uh, leveled up, just waiting for an advancement to hit, and I can just pad the score with them. All right, let's see. There we go. Now, I have quite a few two stars that I don't have, as you can see. Okay. Now, I do have, if you guys saw it, um, I do have Deadpool. He was not behind a paywall as a two-star. But these are all of these champions I don't have as two-stars. So I'm always in a Marvel Insider. Uh, I will try to get the um, exclusives all the time. Anytime I see an exclusive, I get it for Marvel Insider. All right. And last but not least, the one-stars. I got that summoned uh, symbiote which everybody I think has, and I don't have the Deadpool. And that's it. That is uh, my account currently, uh, 2022, and it will keep growing, hopefully. Uh, my focus is now mainly on um, six stars at this point in time. All right. So that's going to do it for the account tour. Hope you had a fun time. Uh, take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the account tour. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.